You gotta go back to where you belong now. Fuji, you gotta go. Don't worry about us. We'll be alright. Get out of here! Can't you see we don't want you anymore? Why can't you go back to where you came from? Leave us alone! Go! Go! Bye, my friend. And scene. There are easier ways to get rid of your old camera gear, like selling it to KEH where it will get a new home, live a new life, and be happy with someone new. And as painful as that might seem, the selling process is actually really easy. You could just do it all on their website and get a quote online, or you could set up a virtual video conference where they'll give you real-time assessments of how much they'll pay you for your gear. I did one recently, so let's check that out. I set up a virtual online appointment with a guy at KEH, and through my webcam here on my computer, he's going to take a look at my gear and give me a price in real time, and then I can decide to sell it to him or not. No risk, no cost. Um, here, I got him in the line. I'm just going to join the Zoom meeting. Hey, Brent, I'm Tony Northup, and I have a whole bunch of stuff I'd like to sell you. Hey, Tony, nice to meet you. Maybe you can tell me a little bit about this process. How does it work? The key part to us is making sure the grading is accurate. Um, that's why uh, we ask that you're in a well-lit room, so if you hold up the equipment, we can see it, because once we determine that the camera is fully functional or lens, there's, there's nothing in the glass, it all boils down to really aesthetics. You know, how far away does a camera look from being brand new? And we assess a grade to it based on that. I'll be more than happy to give you prices as we go through the process. Okay, what if you tell me a price and I don't like it? Like what if I'm good? But you know, if I receive anything and, and the value goes down, let's say if it's a lens and there and there might be some a haze or fungus in it, yeah, um, I'll be more than happy to send it back to you at no charge. So there's no risk. Okay, good. Obviously, you guys buy cameras and lenses. Do you buy other stuff? Like, do you buy flashes or tripods or bags? We do. The amount of bags that we have is a, a little bit limited. It's really more of the higher end bags. Okay. And what about drones? Because I have an old drone that I never get to fly anymore. Yeah. Yep, we sure do. Okay, great. You want to take a look at some gear? Yeah, let's get started. Okay. I have this Canon 5DSR that I have absolutely loved. And I bought it new, and it still seems to be in good condition. I, I don't know what to do. Should I just like hold it up to the camera? Yeah, yeah, that's perfect. And if I can see the bottom of the camera, if you can kind of rotate it around a little bit. I'm using just my webcam on my computer. Do people use their smartphones or tablets? Is all of that work okay? All of that works fine, yeah. Oh, okay, good. And now, do you see any visible wear, scratches, dings, dents, anything like that on the on the body brassing? Yeah, like, can you see on the mode dial there, there's a little yeah. kind of scratch, and oh, then okay. along the top, there's a bit of a, like, along these edges, I can see it's been scraped a little. For that body, I would be able to offer you $825. Okay. Does it matter if I have the box and like the body cap and stuff like that? It really doesn't unless it's virtually brand new. Oh, okay. So I have this big shelf in my closet where I've been saving all the boxes because I thought that would help me get more money when I sold it. But I guess I can just clean that out and throw all that stuff away. Exactly. exactly. Okay, good. Why is it that the prices you offer aren't necessarily what I could get on like Facebook Marketplace? We, we typically offer up to about 65 to 70% of what we're going to sell it at retail. You can definitely make a little bit more selling it outright, but we take care of all the hassles. Um, I provide free shipping directly to you. Uh, we can pick it up at your doorstep if you would like. Um, you don't have to worry about selling it like on um, eBay where somebody can return it up to a, a month later. Um, once we buy it, it's ours. You're done. It can save you some money in the long run if you add up what your time's worth. Yes, and actually that's why I contacted you guys because I had a camera and a lens valued at more than $2,500 just stolen from me 
by scammers. And then on things like eBay, I've had multiple returns for ridiculous reasons. <laughs> we kind of take great pride in the fact that, you know, we're, we're taking this equipment that you've loved and giving it a second life. There are times that we, we get cameras that, you know, it's just not a lot of value, but we always recommend that you get them in the hands of somebody that's going to really kind of take hold of it and love it. Let me show you a different lens. This one's a little more obscure. This is a Sony E-mount 14 millimeter F 1.8 Sigma lens, and I'm selling it because I used it for astrophotography and sure. I liked it, but it's so big and heavy. You guys might need to palletize this thing, in fact. <laughs> but look, there's no scratches on that front element. And that one does have the, the caps with it in the case, is that correct? I think I do, yeah. When you have the original accessories, it does add value to the lens because if we buy a lens from you that does not have caps on it, that's how we sell it. So hold on to that stuff. So that lens, I'd be able to offer you $652 for it. Oh, okay. That seems like a good price. How about this? It's This is essentially a brand new lens. We ended up, we bought it to review it. This is the Canon 600 millimeter F11. It's RF mount. Good deal. How'd you like that? You know what? It's fantastic, but we also got the 800 millimeter F11, and I'm not selling you that one because we absolutely ah. love it. I just, the little extra length made a difference, so we're getting rid of this extra one. As long as you have the caps and the hook for it, I'd be able to offer you $461 for it. Okay, this is a camera that I have loved. <laughs> it is the Fujifilm X-T3. And on there, I have a little pancake lens, the 27 millimeter f2.8. I guess you want to see if there's any yeah, scratches. Yeah, if it's possible to take it out of that case, it would be. Yeah, I can do that. Do you yeah, buy the cool that. little case? Like, would you sell that with it? Yeah, we definitely have um, value on the cases. Yeah, those cases really help protect those cameras. That guy, I would be able to offer you $163 for the lens. And then the body is $561. Oh, okay. That's a pretty good return on my investment. Here's a lens that I bought. I bought this about 12 years ago. Okay. And I bought uh, this Canon. before I knew Chelsea. This is my Canon 500 millimeter F4 lens. Now on that lens, does it have the um, gel holder on it or does it use the drop-in filters? It uses drop-in filters. Perfect. Yeah, Perfect. there. So that guy, I would be able to offer you $2,001. That's not bad because I remember I bought this for $6,500 like 12 years ago. It cost me $4,500 to own for 12 years. Cheaper than running. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Well, I guess if people are interested, they could actually go to keh.com and they could buy some of my gear and give it a whole new life. What happens now? Like we've agreed on prices. I just need the, uh, an accurate count of how many boxes you have and then I'll send you the FedEx labels for it. All you have to do is print them out, attach it pretty securely to the box. Um, I do want to say that when you pack everything up, if you can pick up the box and shake it and feel stuff moving around, it probably needs a little bit more packing material. Okay, cool. Um, I'll shoot you another email here in just a moment and just kind of follow up with the pricing that we have. Okay, thanks awesome. a lot. Take care, bye. All right, Tony, have a great afternoon. We'll talk to you later now. Seriously, that was like the most profitable 10 minutes of my entire life. I made a bunch of money by just showing that guy my gear and now I just need to box it up and send it off. If you want to do the same thing, visit KEH at this link here. And then if you want an extra 5%, why wouldn't you? Use the coupon code TNC Sal, like it shows there, to get that bonus. Thanks so much. And if you have follow-up questions, ask a comment down below and maybe we'll be able to answer them. Bye.